In this video, I'm going to show you how to hide apps using Hide You Calculator Lock. So this is this app on the Google Play. In case you haven't installed it yet, you can just install it and we'll go from here. So I'm going to just open up the app right now and it's going to take a few seconds. There we go. You first have to press agree and continue and then it will say you have to grant some necessary permission. You just want to press grant over here and then after it prompts you, you just want to allow access to manage files. Then from here, as you can see, it will tell you to create your PIN. So we want to press got it. And then you have to enter a four digit password and then press the equals button. So we have to select a password and create it that you will remember. For this instance, we're going to do one, two, three, four, because it's easy to remember and then press equals. Yet again, you will have to then confirm it, press one, two, three, four and equals. And there we go. Then from here, what you have to do is press consent and then you can create a familiar gesture. So you can't really see the screen right now, but it will ask you if you want to create a familiar gesture or use device fingerprints in case you forget the password. I'm just going to skip this right now and then skip again. There we go. And then it's going to start loading for you. And in here, we're going to be able to start hiding apps. And then over here to hide your apps, you want to tap to hide your apps to this icon where it says hide apps. Just click on that. And from here, you can select the apps you would like to hide. So for me, let's say I want to hide Snapchat over here. And then from the list, of course, you can see all the apps on your phone. Just select the ones you would like to hide. So in this instance, as, I'm, as, as I said, we're going to do Snapchat and then we're going to press next. And from here, it says a second home screen will be created for your phone to hide apps. And then you want to press enter. And from here, you have to select the default home app and you have to make it calculator. Okay. So tap on calculator up top, which will make this app the default home app. Once you do this, you'll have to wait for a few seconds for everything to optimize. And as you can see, just like this, you'll get a new home screen, which should be similar to your home screen. And as you can see, it says, welcome to second home screen, check your hidden apps in hide you. You want to press OK. And this screen you're currently using is now actually your main screen on which your apps are hidden. And as you can see, if I go and try to find Snapchat over here, it will be non-existent. As you can see, Snapchat doesn't exist on my device and nobody would know that I actually have it installed already in the back hidden. Okay. So from here, if you then want to access it, you can of course use your phone as you would over here because this is now your main home screen. But if you want to access it, and if you want to get back Snapchat, you want to go to calculator over here and then it will give you an option to put in your password. There we go. Now from here, you want to put in your password, of course, which was one, two, three, four for us. And then you want to press equals. And as you can see, you can then restore your phone's original home screen over here. Now, this is your second phone screen, essentially the one where you have your hidden apps. And as you can see, Snapchat is over here. Now, I pr you probably can't see the screen right now because I'm recording it and it's not showing. However, I'm telling you that uh, you'll be able to see exactly the thing I'm seeing right now. You then want to press restore home screen, which is um, basically an app on your uh, home screen. And if you press restore, it will then restore your home screen via this app. Again, you want to just press system launcher down here, which is the default home screen app. And via that, just like this, your usual home screen is back with Snapchat and everything you may have hidden in the past. So that's pretty much it. That's how to hide apps using hide you calculator lock. I hope this video helped you out. If it did, please subscribe to the channel and help me out as well.